History was made this week as local health care workers succeeded in forming a union. Union advocates say it's the beginning of a trend that was sparked by the pandemic. From employees at a Raleigh Starbucks. Seeing how corporate has behaved during the pandemic has been extremely disheartening. To those in health care. That has been a struggle to be able to maintain a healthy, healthy life and do this work. Workers have reached their breaking point. Whether it's healthcare workers or other essential workers during this pandemic, you know, folks have really gotten fed up with being called essential but tr treated as expendable. And so you're seeing all kinds of organizing efforts right now. Just this week, Piedmont Health nurse practitioners, physicians, midwives, and physician assistants succeeded in creating the first federally qualified health clinic union in the South. North Carolina is not known to be union friendly, but state AFL-CIO president Mary B. McMillan says she expects more efforts to follow and that companies should see the benefit. Workers want their employer to succeed. They want to keep their jobs. So it really doesn't have to be this antagonistic relationship. It can increase cooperation so that management and workers can come together and collectively come up with solutions and improvements in the way that they do business. Jeff Bezos, you can't hide. The great resignation is proof that millions aren't willing to put up with what they have and have reset what they see as important. So folks really are looking not just for higher wages, but for better benefits and flexibility, because I think that the pandemic changed everyone's priorities. And another example just last week, mm -hmm. uh, newsroom employees at the Charlotte Observer agreed to a union. So they're moving forward right. with that. Not in that case particularly, but in many, many cases, corporations spend lots and lots of money as far as hiring attorneys to, to fight it. Um, but in the end, you know, we'll see, see where it goes in North Carolina, but it has not been a huge trend in the past. Right. All right. Russ, thanks. Yeah. Well, the first person to ever 